A big benefit of using on form instead of your camera roll is the fact that you can easily search for videos days, months, and years ago to use for comparisons and analyze progress. To do that, we allow you to create titles for videos as well as create multiple tags for a video, making it very easy to search. Simply long press on a video thumbnail and you'll be able to add titles and create your own tags. Let's take a look. So here we are in a workspace of Michael Jones and I'm on the library. The library is where you'll record most of your videos. And you can see each of these thumbnails has some wording below it. So in addition to who's in the video, we also have the ability to tag and title these thumbnails, which will help in searching and finding videos from the past so you can do comparisons and track progress. So for example, if I long press any video, I can tap edit title. I might say bad swing because they hooked it and I now have that noted as bad swing. Now, if they hooked it, I can long press it and add a tag and type draw, which I happen to have here. And it will tag it also with the word draw. Now, that means I can come up into the search and we automatically surface the various tags you've used within here. In this case, draw, I've only got one. Or if I cancel that and go seven iron, it pulls up immediately every seven iron that I have of this student. And you can see the seven iron is a tag, bad swing, good swing, etc. So with the titles, I can also type G-O-O -O, and it instantly filters down to all thumbnails that I have given it a title of good swing. You might also note things like this was at a tournament or a particular location. You can use titles however you'd like and tags are used to provide additional information. Now, not only does it help to search and find these, we can even go into our all files library and use tags and titles across every video that I've taken of every person in my OnForm account. So I could type G-O here, and you can see every video that has the word G-O in different meanings and uses. So if I for example, type seven, it will filter all seven irons of 163. I could also type seven iron and use multiple tags. I'll tap back here and type SL. And you can see slice is one of the tags I've used in the past. So here we have two videos across two different athletes, one from today and one from February. And now that I've filtered them down, you'll note this little select icon over here. This is a handy shortcut way of tapping select. I can pick these two videos and hit compare. So these are two slice swings from two different athletes. Or of course, I could do all that same searching from within any of my individual workspaces and find all the same type of information. It's just a matter of how often and how many times I use tags and titles to really help me refine my searches and filters. Thanks for watching.